Jamesy, yeah, or not. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. And today, I will be trying to make an animation on paper. Oops, so we just need to let's spice this up a bit. So while I was chilling around, I I I thought I thought of this. After I watched the the FBI series, I noticed how their like proportions work, and I use like and, and I rip I I ripped a bit of paper uh paper, and then I just act as they were like proportions, and I like knew how how they actually work. So let's try to do that. Uh, so what you need is a purple and yellow marker. This little mark will try out a strategy. So good. You need a pencil. Of course, you need a black marker. Remember, make sure you use this on like a clipboard or like another sheet of paper so it doesn't get up everywhere. So, so now we want to start with with you know the torso. Let's start with the head. It's a peanut. It's a peanut. <laughs> yeah. Peanut brain. Can you show yeah. yeah. Okay, let's just think of it as like a little proportion part, please. <laughs> let's just think of that. Let's draw a tiny little circle. The yellow is like the parts where it will be like moving well it's just a little pro strategy i just did it to look good to look good and it makes me feel powerful <laughs> these are the ones that won't be moving at all for example oh no the purple one is the ones who won't be moving at all for example the head <laughs> so let's do this so you want to start The upper torso on the up on, on the body. So now we go to the lower body. The, there's tiny invisible lines, invisible lines, invisible lines. Now we want to think of the legs. The base is just you know circles. Now, now, now we want to add the feet. Invisible line. Invisible line. Now we want to go for the upper arm. Then the hand. Invisible line. Hand, invisible line. So, you made your first proportion character. So let's just see. So, these parts would actually be moving, so they would be yellow. And then, the head would have been, like, purple, because it's not, like, moving, it's not important. Okay, Let's get this guy out of the way. Now we want to know how we want it to move. You don't want it like stand. Well, I don't want it standing still, but you can make it with anything. So. Let's just see. So let's just do, do that, do that. We remember invisible line. Look, doop, da da. That's how. That's how it, it, you might want it to look on like the side. I, I I watch animations. Like I watch animations to know how they move, how smooth they are, everything else. See how smooth they are. Let me just do that again. 
Yeah, here it is. Now you wanna we wanna know what would it look like when it's facing this way. Remember, the other arm that's like on that side is is not supposed to be shown. It is not supposed to be shown. But like the hand can be shown, but you need to draw it in a specific way. I prefer only the hand like like on the side would only work. It also, that arm can also go over the uh bot, bot, um lower torso so don't be afraid to do that. You you can add fingers, you can add little fingers by adding three lines. There's one line the foot it doesn't have to be black but i just wanted a little demonstration now we want to go on the other side the left side so let's do that again but it's the other side If you did what I actually did, uh, I suggest you shouldn't do that because I tried to do something, um, so, so, this is at the, this is at the front. 2, 2D drawing can be kind of complicated, even if I have had, um, Experience with drawing 2D pictures. It's but I'm only good at it when it's on paper. If you have noticed the trailer for the movie, I don't like saying it. It, it feels embarrassing, you know. It feels weird. But let's just say next the Hedgehog movie. So it was. It, it was like it felt impossible to do it because like whole waste of time oh man i i get kind of anxious like drawing on the, the mobile stuff so So we got the character. Now we want to look at the back. We want to see what would, what would it be at the back. Remember, you don't have to draw this exact character. You can like find. Well, you can actually like try to have experiments like doing it in different styles i would not suggest anime i really i really it freaks me out anime freaks me out okay it freaks me out please it freaks me out it freaks me out it really freaks me out <laughs> if, if i see an anime character i it, 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 it just freaks me out okay it Freaks me out. Okay, let's just continue. Remember, the only difference is that you see the back of the hand. You see the actual back of the body. You 
don't have to color the cheese black. Oh, this video is already 10 minutes. Okay. Smooth it. I did this because why not? I you need to really be careful with Sharpie because you can easily make a mistake. But your thing doesn't have to be perfect. It doesn't have to be perfect. But you should really be careful if you make like a mess. Yeah. And, and if it gets on your, like, finger, I suggest you wash it off. If it's a Sharpie, then you should definitely wash it off with, like, a, a lot of, um, soap. But don't overuse your soap, please. Don't overuse it. <laughs> especially when we're in a crisis right now. Especially, especially when we're in the middle of a virus. Please don't. Please, please definitely do not. Okay, so so now we want to trace the things with the sharpie. Bro, I should stop looking through there. You don't have to do this. You need to. You should do this with like a more compatible marker actually like the tiny red ones no it's kind of easy to do it here's that there it is there it is there it is. There it is. So, let's, let's just point out which part, which parts will be moving. Definitely, these parts will actually be moving. Like, just, just the whole arm will be moving. Some of the, like the some of like like the legs. The torso will be moving at all. The head won't be won't be moving at all. So let's just do that. Remember, this is just a little drawing board. This is not the real animation. It's not the real one. And then, bro, I'm confused. I'm confused. They're bumping. They're bumped into each other. Yeah. Okay. That's the upper leg. That's the upper leg. That's. But let's just say this is. This is. These are the upper legs. This is the left upper leg. This is the right upper leg. This is the left upper leg. This is the right upper leg. Same thing with your. Well, this is the right upper leg, and then this is the left upper leg. Because it's on the back. It's the back. It's on the back. Okay? This is the front. So, so, so let me just label the things. Front. 
that's the left view. Right. Back. Right back. All right. And it, it and it's also known as north, south, east, and west. West is right, east is left, I believe. Back is south, front is north. Okay. So like all the body parts will actually be important. Like all every single body part is important. Like no. What is it about? A character walking. I don't know what 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 will I, what will I be using, but this is cool. Mm. Oh, what I'll be using, actually. I really don't know what I'll be using for the animation, but let's just think about this. Then I'll just screen record. Earth, you're moving. Okay. So, we have two software uh, two softwares that we use bath art or power 